Hello, I'm going to uh, show you how to make uh, finger beams. Um, this cool illusion uh, appears that you've got uh, stretchy uh, elastic beams between each of your fingers. Uh, here's the uh, base video and I put a black dot on each finger so that I can track them. I called the thumb number one, uh, index finger two, middle finger three, ring finger four, and pinky fingers number five. And that's important. Uh, as you'll see during my uh, tutorial. Add a null layer and duplicate that four times so we have a total of five null layers. Each null layer is for a finger and we'll rename those. The first one we'll call one. One is the thumb. Two, three, four, and five. Five fingers. And the uh, the tracking data uh, will be applied to these uh, null layers. Okay, now let's uh, add a new solid layer, and we'll call it beam. And we're going to add the uh, the effects um, generate beam, and that will give you that. Uh, green, greenish bluish line and go up to the uh, the length and make the change it from 25 percent to a hundred percent. You want that a hundred percent length. Okay now we'll duplicate the beam layer nine times so we have a total of ten beams. Ten beams and we're going to rename these one, two, that's this the first one will be attached to the thumb, which is number one, and the uh, index finger, which is number two. The next one will be attached to the thumb, finger three, the thumb, finger four, thumb, finger five. And then finger two to finger three, finger two to four, finger two to finger five and uh, finger three to finger four, finger three to finger five, and finger four to finger five. And that will attach each finger to each other finger. As you can see here, one to two, one to three, one to four, one to five. There is your two to three, two to four, two to five. There's your three to four and three to five. And finally four, line four to uh, finger five. Now go into Mocha and track. I'm not going to go into detail. I assume you know a little bit about Mocha tracking. And I'm using the corner pin tracking. And you only need one corner pin. So I use the top right corner. I don't care where the other three corners go, but you need to uh, track the fingers. So um, each of my data will come from the top right corner pin. Now you're going to uh, export uh, the corner pin data from Mocha. Go into After Effects. Um, go into your first uh, null, which is your thumb. Uh, copy and paste. And you see you've got your upper left, upper right, lower left, lower right. We only are interested in the upper right. So click that little icon, the clock icon, and um, uh, delete the upper left, um, lower left, and lower right, and keep only the upper right. Now go back into Mocha and copy the uh, data for uh, the next finger and apply that to uh, null number two. And again, click the uh, little clock icon to delete the upper left, lower left, and lower right. We only want the upper right. Okay, you're going to do that with each of the five fingers. And this is what uh, your uh, project should look like. You've got the five null layers, and only the upper right corner pin data is all you want. Now with your beams 
Now we're going to uh, add an expression for each of your beam layers and pick whip the starting point will be starting from the thumb one and the ending point will be finger number two. Now repeat that process uh, for the uh, next beam. We'll be starting from the thumb, one, and ending uh, the middle finger, which is three. So it's kind of a simple process from here on out. And so here, um, this beam will start again with finger one, the thumb, and will be ending with finger four. And uh, this one will be pick whip the uh, starting point again, finger one, the thumb, ending, finger five, pinky. And we'll do that with all of these beams. It's the same process with each one. Two, three will begin with finger two and end with uh, finger three. This one begins with finger two, ends with finger four. This one again begins with finger two and ends with finger five. It's the same process. But as long as you did a good job with your tracking and mocha, uh, you're going to be happy with your results here when we're done. You'll see what we've got. If you need to uh, go into Mocha and uh, update or change your um, tracking, uh, make sure that you uh, delete the uh, the points, the data points that you have in that you've already pasted into After Effects, and uh, reset the uh, data uh, before you uh, repaste the new uh, keyframes for the uh, corner pin. Okay, here's your final result. This is kind of cool, isn't it? It appears that you've got a uh, rubber band attached to each finger. And you can see the black, I, my black, the little black dots were so big, they're, they're a little noticeable. So I added optical flares. I um, parented optical flares to each finger and uh, cranked up the, uh, the illumination and uh, gave it a glow. And uh, that's the final result. Okay, I hope this was helpful. Have fun.